welcome, welcome my viewers to the program Celebrate Your Moment with Joy. By now I know, you know, I am in the kitchen. So today is Thursday when I bring you uh, Celebrating in the Kitchen with Pastor Florence. In a snap snapshot, my weekly schedules are Monday through Wednesday. I bring you inspiration word. Thursdays like today, celebrating the kitchen because what we put in this body is of importance because our bodies are the temple of the Holy Spirit. You, your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. Feed it well. With me here, I have old fashioned oats. I'm going to be basing my sharing. Today, I'm sure I'm going to go beyond what I normally share, but it's very, very important, okay? <laughs> Somebody said everything I say important, okay? So, I'm going to be basing my sharing uh, from Rook 6, 32, about giving. Give, and it will you will receive. Your gift will return to you in full, placed down, shaken together to make room for more, learning over and poured into your lap. The amount you give will determine the amount you get back. That is New Living uh, Translation. New King James Fashion says this. Give, oh, oh. Give and it shall be given unto you. Good measure. Placed down, shaken together, and learning over, shall men give into your bosom. For with the same measure that you, you give, the same you shall receive again. Why would I be bringing in the kitchen, give and it shall be given? These are the scriptures we hear when people are giving overing. But I want to tell you something. What I'm about to make here is about giving. This knowledge was given to me, and I'm coming to give to you. Freely have I received, freely I give. Not every person can be able to come to the media, but I'm here. Because the Great Commission, we have all been given. So I'll be making what you would call, it, would call maybe Ugali kind of, of oats. But uh, this is all old-fashioned oats. And we know that, first of all, let me educate you here a little bit. My water is boiling here. Now, um, it says... The calories is 150. These oats, they are very good. Oats are good with fiber. And it also have calories, so it will make you full. And it's also healthy. This container I kept because of you. Otherwise, I have my oat graded. You get the old the oats. Um, I was hoping I'll get the ones which are not graded, but that's okay. When you buy the oats, you know, you make oatmeal. But you can make... Ugadi or fufu if you are from the western side that's what i'll be doing i had already boiled some water and i'm gonna do it you know the very first time i made it was a bomber because i did it like Ugadi and it oh my goodness it was so hard it was very hard the way i made it um but now i have learned we learn things in life you can never exhaust knowledge i'm gonna leave this one here just in case um uh, Something else happened. So I have it here. It's the one I, that was put here. And this remained. And I said, please do not discard the, the container because I want to show my viewer and my listener. And in this, I must say that we count the cost. I was given the knowledge. The knowledge was shared to me. And I am here. And the good thing is this. When you make this healthy stuff, eh, you also exercise your muscles. Look, my muscles are, I'm exercising them. That's why it is always good to celebrate every moment. You don't have to be dull, you don't have to be groomy. Rejoice, rejoice in the Lord always. And again, I say rejoice, rejoice in the Lord always. And again, I say rejoice, rejoice, rejoice. And again, I say rejoice, rejoice. And again, I say rejoice, rejoice in the Lord always. And again, I say rejoice. You know what? We only have one life. We don't have to be so serious about it. We need to make fun about it. The good thing with this one, unlike the Ugari, you don't have to wait it to be so uh, to be so much on the fire. I also I don't know the, whether that is how it's done, but because I've done it several times now, I I, I also invented my own way. After I I stir it like this, I put it in another container and I put it in there in the microwave for like three minutes and i realize it swells it gets bigger and bigger so just a small amount will be so much and sorry i always have to go time and again escape there so you see now that's done okay 
halfway done, I put it here on a container here and I'm choosing a transparent container so that you can see. The advantage I've seen about this one, it doesn't stick much with the ugari on the cooking pot, which is an advantage because of washing the dishes. If I want to use the same pot, I don't know whether, I don't know whether you are like me. There are some cooking pots I repeat and I repeat, I reuse and I use again, 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 and again because they are convenient. So look, it does not even stick, but it's, that is how we're done. Okay, how we're done. I'm going to put it in the microwave. I'll cover it well. Make sure when you are using the microwave, you don't use plastic stuff because they have a lot of particles, you know, for cancer, that's why cancer is on the lies. I'm not a doctor, disclaimer here. I'm not even saying that I, 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 I discovered that, but one and one, you can add one plus one. So that's my oatmeal, fufu, ugari, whatever you want to call it, or bread, then I'm going to cover it. I'm going to cover it and put it in the microwave. I'm going to put it in the microwave for three minutes. And the day I think I added even more. Then the side dish that I'm going to use with for the vegetables, I have tomatoes. I got two tomatoes here. I have celery. For celery, I would advise when you buy, please use it when it's green because it, 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 it loses its nutrients if it is white, if it gets to be yellow or white, okay? Then I used a medium-sized onion. Let, you can use whichever onion you want to use, either red or whatever. This one now I can draw, but uh, if I'll be telling you something, I better keep it there. Then I have three eggs. I decided no, I just uh, crushed them. Uh, there are three, you can see. One, two, three. God help me to have a drone camera or uh, that I'll be able to you'll be able to see wherever I am at. So and then for the spices, I'll be using curry powder. I'll use pepper. You can either either black pepper or whichever pepper you can use. You can if you are the kind who like to use oh uh, this is my pot here. So I'm gonna put it there. Here uh, and I'll use vegetable oil. I know Coconut oil is good, but a piece of artifice from me. Oh, when you are using oh, coconut or olive oil, they are very healthy. But when it comes to frying, it's good you put it like it's like oh, salad because when you are frying it, it, it emits a lot of smoke, which might not be very good even for the small ones. Okay, I'll also be using you can use spices of your choice. I'll be using the turmeric. Um, I think I am out of the garlic salt or garlic powder. That's okay, whatever you have, but you can use garlic. Um, and now, as that one is going on, I'll come back and I'm doing this. I'm just starting this, my three eggs. And oh, the reason I made this is because both uh, to be a complete meal is uh, I know there are so many people who are busy. I am busy, my friend. We are all busy, but we still need to take care of this body. We need to take the body, okay, our body. The body, you know, it's like the car in America. You can't, it's hard. You can't survive without a car in America. It's like your legs, like the public means. The same, our bodies are important. They are the ones, you, you use the body to, I use the body to pray to be very energetic. People wonder why I am doing all this because I take care of myself. I love myself. You know, we grew to be taught like, by the way, I'm just keeping it busy because the onion is still cooking anyway. Um, I grew, you know, I don't know whether you are like me, but when we grew up, it's like when you love yourself, it's like not good. But we have come to know that the Bible specifically says, love your neighbor as you love yourself. Okay, I'm multitasking here. Let me check. Oh yeah, I'm going to add three more minutes. So it will be total of six. You can do it whatever you want. So, but we know the Bible says love your neighbor as you love yourself. Grammatically. That is to say you have to love yourself first, then be able to love somebody else. I also talk about self-abuse. You must not abuse your health. You must not abuse your body. Does that mean that you're going to be perfect? No, you do what you can and you leave it to God. When you are frying the onions, using the onions, I like to say time and again, when more you overcook, 
the more you kill the nutrients. We also grew to know that it is good that you fry until the onion become brown. It's gonna be spicy, yes, but it will have lost the nutrients. Then I'll put my celery there, okay? There we go. I have the celery there. Uh, and I'll be stirring, stirring, stirring. Then I'll add the two tomatoes. There we go. Remember, I am trying to make this as a full meal for you and your family, okay? So, I can cover that and then we can be talking here. So the break your moment is about valuing every moment that you have because every moment counts and every moment matters. And because I am busy, sometimes I forget to prepare it put everything had uh, here, so I'm gonna be getting another container because I wanna show you. Oh, I wish I had a bigger one. Yeah, I'm gonna put two. The reason being, I have a bigger one, but you're not gonna see through it. So I'll be using this one when my food is done, my dish is done, and I wash another one here so you can see. That's how much I I love you, and I'm counting the cost. That's why I have sung this song and you need to subscribe, you need to listen to it, and I know you'll be blessed. It talks about counting the cost. Right now, I'm counting the cost of my time and preparing all this because of you. It says, Gutara Garama, Gutara Garama, Gutara Garama, Yoho no Kyoto do, Yesonya Tarire Garama Honoke. Gutara gara ma yo hono kyo kia beri ya niatiri mwakire de waka nyo ba ya taraga ama ya nyo ba binyere ke ona we mura sa no binya tarage garama ya ma odu we kagani gutara gara ma gutara gara ma gutara gara ma yo gi ma wa mwere wa kwa so Yesonya tari de garama hono ke Gutara garama yogi ma wa mwere Oh now my friend Under the sound of my voice You need to count the cost of your health Hey! Hallelujah! So, I'm starting here And I can see now it's ready I'm gonna put my spice My spices This is curry powder No, for those who mention here Don't I measure with eyes with my eyes, my very typical one here. There we go. I never feel like I have made everything well without a turmeric. And then crushed pepper there. And guess what? We have okra leaf, dry okra leaf. I'm gonna add some dry okra leaf. They are like uh, Syrian to fritz. Here we go. Now when you do this, it's the first kind of get sticky. So what I would advise, you put on the side, you separate on the side your contents, then you put a little bit of some um, uh, vegetable oil so that the, your egg does not stick before it is done. There we go. And now I am ready to put my eggs. These are three eggs, remember, okay? If you have cilantro in the house, the fresh one, you can put them. I did not have them. Oh, I think I have oregano, oregano leaves. I have oregano leaves. I'm going to put them. They ask me what all this. You know, that's how I do it. I mix stuff, whatever I have. I just put it there. And, oh, if I forget to do this, I, the next thing, I'm going to do things in a hurry and it's going to spill. Oh. Keep it there. So, here is my, these are my three eggs here. I remember you separate in between, you make a, 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 an empty space, there, a clear space. Uh, then I put my eggs there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, pray for me that I get a drone camera so I can be, it can be going through like this, even though somebody has to be there. And, and the way I try to do this is because I want to encourage you. As a mentor, I want to mentor you. So that you don't just eat in any hurry, you don't just put any kind of food on the table for your family. Yani, be a smart mother, be a smart cook, be a smart uh, considerate mother. I'm starting it, I'm starting, I'm starting the challenges. 
is taking on the pot, but that's okay. You keep on stirring continuously, continuously. Then I am gonna taste, but I will pray because I did not pray from the beginning. Let's pray. But you know what? The Bible does not say somewhere, anywhere we close our eyes. We close to avoid distraction. So I'll pray, but I'm still opening my eyes. And God, I want to thank you for this knowledge I'm sharing with your people. Thank you for the one who shared this, my working colleague. Bless him. Thank you, Jehovah God, for the knowledge we get out there so that we can come and share. Continue to bless me, even as I prepare this meal, that the few, my few and my listener, that the sound of my voice will benefit this to take care of their bodies uh, in a healthy way. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Now, I want to taste whether it has salt. Oh, do the African way. Okay. I'm doing it the African way. Mmm, mm -hmm. it's hot. No, so, I'm gonna add some salt. Mm, salt to taste, salt to taste, salt to taste. There we go. Mm -hmm. And I'll taste it again. The pepper, I don't do it like those people from West Africa. I mean, uh, um, okay, mine is mildly spicy, okay? Uh, I have so many friends who share with me these ideas. Cool, cool. Okay, now, hey, this is so good. That's the food here, the side dish for. Remember, the fufu is still there. I'm gonna, I think it's gonna fit this one. Let's see here. Hey, hey, hey. Good, good, good food. Good, healthy food. Good, healthy food. I was at this meeting my container. Okay, so. It's sticky a little bit, and I like to scratch the bottom of a cooking pot. That's just me. You don't have, I always feel like it's a bit like I seem to just put water here. I like to scrub, and I enjoy it. If it was not hot, I'll be wrapping it with my finger here. But for now, let me behave a little bit in, the, in front of the camera. But I'm going to eat it, okay? I'm in the kitchen. Anyway, mm -hmm. I know I should not be talking with the food in my mouth, but I'm teaching. So I'm going to be accused for that. Okay. If I was not in the camera and had time, I could have taken the, the fufu of garlic and scratch it there. When I eat it, and it tastes good. Okay. Now, uh, because of the noise of the water, let me just put the... Okay, now this is it's hot. One minute. Here we go. There, there is onion, celery, oregano leaves, dried okra leaves, turmeric, eggs, tomatoes. Vegetable oil, curry powder, crushed pepper. You can use black pepper or whichever. Okay. So, now, my other meal, part of the meal is here. I'm sure it's hot. Here it is. Here it is. I said it doesn't get hard like our ugali. But this one is so filling. Now, if it's a kid you are giving, you can give them with kefa or masiwamara. You can also take it with vegetables like sukumawiki. You can take it with chapati. You can take it with rice. You can take it with a bread like sandwich. I don't know whatever you will call that sandwich to be. I'm going to get a, a bread knife here and I'll cut and I'll put it on the plate. That's why I say today, they are with me. We go all the way. Here is the plate. Now, watch this. Okay, so... It's really hot. This is food. This is let me hold it. This is old, old fashioned ugari kaid or fufu or whatever you'd like to call it. This is now a complete meal. You'll be putting a drink, maybe water, whatever. Okay. Now, because I want to go all the way. Here you go, you can cut it. It's not gonna be as hard as we are used to. 
get down um, you see here but it's so good i'm getting used now to it at first it was kind of uh, but um, i'm getting there so because it's not gonna be like the kuhari we make let me use this one too to get it here. Okay. You can put it there on this side. Okay. Now, see, you put this one. And it's ready to go. It's hot. I'm gonna go, I'm not gonna eat now. And this can have a serving of five people because it's so filling. This just may look like it is more. But it feels a lot. It makes you full so quickly. And now, you have all the calories that you need here. You have the proteins in the eggs. You have the anti-cancer fighting properties in the onion. You have the vitamins in the tomatoes. In all these spices, anti-inflammatory properties in the turmeric curry powder to spice it if you want to spice it more i do not put a lot of spices in case my people don't like my family does not like a lot of spices and this can make how many serving the way it is can make five servings for five people can you imagine that with three eggs one onion you know eating healthy is not expensive as people think but you know we can always listen out i don't have that time you do you don't have time my brother my sister when the doctor gives you bed rest because your cholesterol is high, your blood sugar is high, your blood pressure is high, he will give you a bed rest. He will be telling you to eat all those kinds of things. What will you do? And I think I have not done that before, but I think I, I can also sprinkle the, 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 the okra dried leaf here. Make it more green, more healthier. So, coming back to giving you know, give and shall be given unto you. I know there are some people out there who've been concerned that I give so much and I don't gain. Let me tell you, my brother, my sister, when you give, our God is not unjust according to Hebrews 6.10. To forget the good work we give, we do. I, God is not unrighteous to forget the, the, the knowledge I'm giving you. It is now yours for the, uh, for the taking. You decide to take it. I've given you this knowledge. When you try it and it is hell and you become healthy, God is gonna pay me. And when I reach there in heaven, God gave me your be ma uh be ne are re do be do be ne are re do be do be ata na ne are re do be do be ne are re do nyoro do be daga wo iru ne are re do be do be ne are re do be taji imewe kwa tayari taji taji imewe kwa tayari taji taji imewe kwa tayari taji I am done, but I want to pray that the Lord will put a desire in you, a passion in you, to be considerate of what you eat, of what you put in on the table. Before you take a spoon and eat, like me here, what is that you are putting in your body, the temple of the Holy Spirit? That's why you can go back and watch what I've been teaching your environment keeping it tidy, you know, even your own body keeping it tidy, because cleanliness is second to godliness. Taking care of your body concerns God a lot, and I'm gonna be done. Hey, before I forget, celebrate your moment. Eh, we have gone to another place. Every Wednesday now, we'll be switching. Encouragement. We are now. Oh, I have Hannah, Hannah, all the way from Kenya. Every Wednesday, every Wednesday, every Wednesday, if you did not, did not watch yesterday, you better do it. She will be bringing in the moment. You, we can also bring you in the moment. If you are, desire to bring something in the moment, but she wants to, us to be focusing more on the boy child. So you go through it, see where you can fit. You know what? Celebrate your moment is where you come and learn. Me as a mentor, just come. You may, some mother may say, oh, is the credit going to be okay? You know what? God is concerned about what you deliver. It is the anointing that matters. I'm saying this in the kitchen because my kitchen is not the best. But at least I can make something and make you be knowledgeable. 
My YouTube channel may not be up to the standard, but at least there is something you can grasp. Don't miss these things. And I know God will bless you. So Monday through Wednesday, inspirational word, Thursday like today here, Friday like tomorrow, putting on the right gear for the weekend. Then Saturday, Saturday, may God to go to church. If you go to church on Saturday, don't miss. If you go to church on Sunday like me, don't miss. Then we continue. Subscribe to my channel. Share with other people. Practice what you learn. Tell us what you can do. And we're going to assess, you know, at uh, celebrate your moment with joy where we can plug you in. Hannah just told me, can we be doing something? I said, oh, come on in. Lily, she said me and somebody said, it is okay. It is good. Nobody was born knowing. Yeah, I'm going to give people knowledge. I was mentored. I mentor. I'll, I've been counseled. I'll counsel. I'll, I'll give you the counsel. I, will rebu I was rebuked. I've been rebuked. I will rebuke you, with, but with love, you know. So may the Lord God bless you. This is from the kitchen of Pastor Florence. May the Lord God bless you. Father, I want to thank you. This show has gone beyond the minute I do, but it was important from the beginning to the end to inspire my few and my listeners, especially the young mothers, to be careful of what they put on the tables. God, as I continue to do this, I pray that your grace shall be sufficient for me. I pray that my few and my listeners will not just listen and not just gain anything. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Now, because your body is of importance, your soul is of importance, your mind is of importance, I want to encourage you to build your mind by going to school, to build your soul by committing your life to the Lord. You are there, you have never given your life to the Lord. I want to invite you to let the Lord come into your heart. Do you want to say this prayer after me? Right in the kitchen, yeah. Say, Lord Jesus, I thank you for your word, even through the demonstration in the kitchen. Now I want to take care of my soul. I give my life to you. Forgive me my sins, write my name in the book of life, and give me a desire to grow spiritually in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. If you have done, pray that prayer by faith, you've been transformed. The wood is gone and the new has come. Start walking in the newness of life. But two things are important. Testimony of what has happened in your life and also joining a group of believers. Identify a home church where you'll be able to go and be part of that because together we grow strong in Jesus' name. May the Lord God bless you. Remember to celebrate every moment, not just celebrating it, but celebrating it with joy in the kitchen, wherever you are going, when you are driving, putting on the right gear for the weekend, all this things are important i love you god loves you the most give and it shall be given unto you see wa mchoyo na ile hekima na maarifa mungu amekupatia yesu alipeana maisha yake sababu yako na sababu yako kwa nini na wewe wa mchoyo na hiyo hekima yako mimi lord god bless you thank you